What's going on my fellow anime gamers, this is Shadow here with another game unboxing and today we're going to be taking a look at the newly released Naruto Ultimate Ninja Storm 4 for the PS4 and or Xbox One. Now if you don't already know this, it has been confirmed that this will be the last Storm game in the series which is really sad but at the same time we, we're all super hyped for this game so we don't really care. We're going to wait out with to uh, see whatever the next game is going to be. So, uh, as I was saying earlier, this version I got is the one that came with the little figure included. So, we're going to go ahead and look at that. But before I actually get into this, I'm going to go ahead and show you my other collection of the Storm games that I have in my possession. So, let's start out with uh, Naruto Ultimate Ninja Storm, the original one, right here, which is actually the limited edition with the steelbook case on it. We got Naruto in the front. Sasuke in the back, and then if you go ahead and open them, this had the little soundtrack in it, and it was pretty cool. This is the actual cover art from the, the plain plastic case, but, you know, I was lucky enough to find this one, so... Here's Ultimate Ninja 1. Next up is Ultimate Ninja Storm 2. This was the first one that split off onto the 360. Here's the front, the back, you know, all that good stuff. And the latest in the numbered series would be... Ultimate Ninja Storm 3. Now I know in between these I, there was Generations and Revolution, but I didn't keep those because they were just filler games anyway, so you know, that was those three. Now, let's go ahead and uh, get to the actual game, shall we? Let me just get a random sharp object that won't kill me and open this plastic up. I really don't want to drag this video on for too long. So, here's the front of our box. Here's the back of the box, and see what's inside. We have a little insert for Play Anime. I don't know what that's all about. I'm going to go into that. Here's our actual disc, which is actually pretty simple, but you know what? I like that. So, that's Naruto Ultimate Ninja Storm 4. I'm going to go ahead and pop this into my PS4 so I can deal with the stupid install that I'm going to have to deal with. And last but not least, the part that you probably all were waiting for is the little Naruto, uh, what is this, um, Funko figure now. Originally I thought that this was just going to be a, you know, a gold Naruto figure, but apparently, as you can see right here, it is a mystery mini, so I don't actually know what we're going to get. So let me just go ahead and take this stupid plastic off, and we shall see what it is that I got. So, fingers crossed, it's someone alike. And it's in a little plastic wrap. Awesome! Now, apparently, these things are ten, ten US dollars, so I, I took the little tag off of here, but that's crazy. This... Let's see. No, I did get a, a Naruto figure. Okay. Well, that's pretty cool. So, it looks like these little things are 10 US dollars, which is kind of mind blowing considering the, the amiibo, which I think are pretty good looking, are only about $3 more. But here he is, my little uh, gold Naruto figure. He's doing the, uh, the shadow clone hand sign, which is pretty cool. So, there he is. Wonderful stand. Yes, he will. So that's going to do it for this video, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, be sure to hit that like button. And then if you already haven't, subscribe to my channel. I got more videos like this coming up. So I'll see you guys next time.